Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 17 of the Kenshi Project Genesis World, World, ah, World Mod. Um, this is the, the faction we're building and I want to get, come back in today. I've done a little bit of work off stream, nothing too much. I fed everyone, I put one building down, I think I finished two little storage spots right here. And that's pretty much it. I collected some ore, sold it, got some money built up, nothing too much, went and fed all my people. And I found out on Reddit that there's actually a way to reset the pathing. It's Control Shift and F11, which is this, Control Shift F11. It doesn't pop anything up because I just did it, but it resets all the pathing for everything, the buildings, everyone doing stuff. So if anything's messed up, I like maybe see the nomads going up here compared to going through the road. Maybe this will fix it. I don't know. Uh, I, I forgot the guy's name who did it. Maybe I'll put it down in the comments below. Uh, but I really appreciate him answering. It's on the, in the Kenshi red, subreddit. I asked the question, and he was the only one who responded. And he hopefully answered my question. Because I love the fact that people are so helpful in this community and helping each other out. So thank you again for all of you that are watching this little playthrough. It's been a lot of fun. It focuses me into a forcing me to game every day off stream and play something I really enjoy. And I'm having a lot of fun with it, man. I mean, like, I'm going to go over today's objective today for me. Um, we're going to go up to the way station. We're going to go to the town. We're going to go to, I think this is called Vane's Pass. I can't remember the name of it. And then we're going to go up here to the hub and we're going to visit all three, all four. And we're going to buy what we need to get weapon production going as soon as possible. While that's happening, we're going to let the people build some buildings. I'm looking for the other shell for that, like, I think it's called the uh, seashell house. It looks like a, a, a snail shell, okay? It's, oh, it has a door on the inside. Like, you go in, in the door, there's an open area, and there's a big open area. And I'm trying to find that. I think it's called Colossal Buildings or something like that. I don't remember the name. I moved some people off a little bit. Every other spot stayed, but I found something. I didn't know how. I, maybe I just missed it a million times. I was looking around, and up here, there's a copper node with two people on it. Um, like they're both on it right now, and over here is a uh, iron node. And this iron node is right on the like everyone who walks by, everyone just attacks this guy a million times. So I said, "Nah, nuts to that," and I stopped it. And we're apparently getting attacked again. Passengers, who? Harbin. Who's Harbin? You're being attacked here? By who? Like, there's no one here. All right, let's see what happens. He's being targeted. He was being targeted. And now he's not. Huh, no idea. Okay, so the other thing I noticed, with the reason I had to go find that pathing issue, um, some of my guys are actually starting to starve. And they're getting to the point where they really, like his hunger right here for this guy, Cole, I had to give him a bunch of food. He was just having issue after issue after issue going back out eating. And I'm hoping by resetting the pathing, when they come back in and drop this ore here, uh, they'll run into this place to get the food barrel right there. And I also did build one electronic uh, refinery, iron, iron iron refinery too. This was a manual iron, iron refinery. This one needs one worker. This one needs three. So I'm probably going to build another one as soon as my power is figured out. I did build um, a battery here. I got a chest with some a little bit of supplies, and I started building backpacks. Nothing too major. Uh, they take cloth. They take raw hot animal skins. I don't have access to fabrics here for some items. Um, I built another. I think last episode I built this windmill. I'm trying to remember. I can't uh, remember exactly. This is the weapon smith. This is the basic medical supply area, and then another battery. Now this weapon thing here. The re the only reason. I'm not building katanas right off the bat, okay? I don't have anyone that I know of with weapons crafted. I'm going to look really quick with you guys here and see if we have someone because it's a weaponsmith right here, number one. So we're going to go through kind of rapidly. I'm going to see if we have and we have anyone with more than one. If not, we're going to go up to the hub and try to recruit that really cool Scorchlander. I think her name's like, I'll just butcher her name, I don't know, and hope we can grab her. And if she, if we can, hey, great. We'll have someone with like 30 weaponsmithing. If not, we'll just have to get someone going, and I really don't like that idea. I'll recruit. I'm going to go through all the places I said today, the four cities, well, three three cities, one town, and try my best to find someone through everyone. I'm hoping to God this works. I don't know. I don't think we're going to have any luck here. I think it's no joy, boys. 
Shit. Right, let's try the uh, Expendables. A couple of them have Weapon Crafting 5, but they are really good fighters. As you can see, they all have weapons contained like 40. These people are amazing. Let's go to the crew real quick. Negative 1. Nice. Negative 2. 3 on Freeze. The freeze is our highest. Baladek is 2. Tiger Warrior is 3. Lazy, of course. Lazy, of course, has 17. Of course he does. So we might have to use him a little bit. Because my idea is to get not only one or two of these going, but since we have 80, like if you look at the save file, right? If I save it, um, I'm not going to click it, but 83 members. We have 83 people now in this faction because we've recruited to those um, those expendables, which, I God, I wish I had record, recruited more. If I had known they were that good, I would have recruited every single one in that pile. Instead, I've recruited six, which maybe I'm not even allowed to do. I don't even know. So this building's done here. I also found out the power to that has been fixed for the thing. I want to rip down these two buildings. Um, right now, Frostin and Jaga's mom are operating as construction people, and they're also cooking when they have nothing else to do. But we have a tremendous amount of food. So let's go. What is Tamaris doing? Ditching resource. What are you ditching? Don't ditch. Oh, they're all going to start ditching food, aren't they? Uh, maybe, maybe this is for the best. Maybe, they, maybe it is for the best. I don't actually know, because right now, this food barrel, um, yeah, let's go see, he's going to dump it off, yeah, he dumped it off, are you going to go back to work, god dang it, Tamaris, who's this dude, hungry bandit, starving bandit, we could beat him up even more, and I'm just not in the mood, freeze his meat, yeah, I've been, I've been running some stuff back and forth, We've been gathering a lot of resources, and I want to make sure we don't abuse it and waste it. Um, freeze, get me here. Come here. Ditch, 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 ditch. I, gr I bought what I could back. Um, I'm going to put this in here and see if this shit starts cooking. If they fix, got fixed, I'll be so goddamn happy. I can't even describe it. I've been waiting for a while. Range this, too. We're going to send Freeze out on a mission with these other guys. When he gets over here to this group of people... I'm going to give him like 16 ore. 16 is like the, the magic number right now. Um, we'll send that group up to the, uh, right up to the wave station. I don't want to waste time today. I really don't. I, I know I've been playing some episodes here where I'm not, I'm losing focus a little bit because that's the way I play. I, I want to do everything at once and I can't. And um, let's see, how fast is he now? He is, oh, sorry. He is 15. That's, that's decent. We'll send him over. I know I lose track of some of the stuff I'm doing because I always think, oh, man, what's, what's going on here? What's going on here? And I, I get things done, but I'm not in the right order sometimes. I'm not the most super efficient. I'm not trying to be. I'm trying to be a, a gamer that when people watch me play uh, anything, I want you to be, like, entertained, have some fun. But I also want you to be like, oh, man, I can play this game as well easily. And I might even do better than him and believe it's true. Not like, oh, I'm the best gamer in the world and you can't ever play on my level. That's not the kind of gamer I enjoy. I enjoy watching people and going, oh, man, if I own this game, I would have built differently. I would have put a different building here. I would have put some walls here. I mean, I was debating putting walls up here, by the way. I really was. I'm, I'm really thinking that might be the case. Now that this is here, I'm going to undo some things. One, we're going to go to here and we're gonna, oh, we'll learn the, the stuff I bought when I was off stream. Uh, split rail fencing, already known, already known. Junk bow. Learned. Toothpick. Learned. Those are both uh, the really low-end crossbows that the bandits usually carry. That should let us uh, build them now if we want to. Show research. Uh, there's nothing in the queue. That's why they're not researching. Wow, they researched everything? Wow. I'm a little surprised. Uh, oh, my. Okay. Hemp oil bulk fuel generator theory. What I want to know is, well, light post two. Okay. Light What's this one down here? Light post efficiency, a more efficient light post. Okay. Battery power three. I'll put that up first. We're paying the cost here, by the way. Um, battery capacity two. The good thing about this stuff, it goes very quick. I didn't realize it was going to go that quick. Basic exterior lighting, sure. Defense, defensive bunkers, uh, imprisonment. We can we could build cages. Uh, yeah. Farming, we've got all that. Industry. The one thing I got to figure out is while we're over there, I got to make sure we are not missing something. What are we missing here? Rice weed times two. 
Okay. Hemp farming. We need hemp. Hashish production. Don't crash. Uh, engineering research times one. I do need some engineering researches, by the way. Wood processor upgrade for forestry. Uh, okay. Ancient science book times three. Ore drill, which requires ancient science books. So we're gonna we're getting to the point where we need good stuff. AI core, ancient science book. We need as much ancient science as we could find. Basic weapon guards seven. Training, turret training, crossbow training, slavery, prison, prison cage, prison pole. Searchlights, sure. I think that's everything. I don't think we have any more books to buy anything, so there we go. We'll let them work on that. That should let them go. Now, they're done, research-wise. Um, like I said, everything down here has been modified a little bit. I got rid of the, the worst iron posts back here. We're going to walk by. Let's let them get, go up here. Um, I'm, we're going to unpause this building. That'll let them. They have to put um, 35 building materials here. We're actually going to build a second one, too. Let's go for a buildings, not hive, buildings. Bug house? Yeah, that's the bug house. I like the bug house. Here's the L house. That's the bar that a lot of people use. That's like the bar down in Squin. Uh, large house, old? No. Double house, gray? Nope. I don't remember which one I want. What's this called? This is called a long house one. So let's see if we can get one of those. Long house, long house, long house. Okay, another one of these. I was debating this because what I'm going to probably end up doing is getting rid of these buildings, but they, these only have one entrance in and one entrance out. So I got to really be judicious with how I put them down. There's one entrance over here. There's one entrance over here. So another one this way, like maybe like facing something kind of lying along the lines of other. This might be good. Or maybe if I put another one down here or maybe flip it around along these lines, do something like this. And then we have a central court area is not a bad idea to me. So I think I'm going to do that like right here and put it a little bit back. Let's rotate a little bit, make sure it doesn't look completely terrible. You can rotate this a little bit like that. I could put it up a little bit like this. Um, that looks decent-ish. Not really, actually. Like that. Like, that looks decent. All right, let's go like this. We'll do this. We'll raise it up. It's going to affect my wind. It'll probably not affect my wind too much. And we'll put it right here. And we'll confirm it. Now, what this does, we have a, a, a non-functional courtyard. But if I want to put more crops in here, like not good ones, I could put them in there. Or I could put like a training area. I could put something. I'm trying to make a central area here and get off of this area over time. Like, I don't mind if construction's there or there's a little wall. We're going to probably build a wall too. But between these, it's 24 and 35. That's 59 building material. How many do we have? We have 57. So we don't have enough and we don't build enough. And that's fine because we'll bring more when we come back. Let's go to let's go to freeze. We'll follow him for now. And hopefully nothing really crazy goes on while this is going on. I'm going to move a little faster today. I'm going to go like the mid range. Someone did mention that like, hey, uh, you know you're in like, slowest speed. I'm like, I didn't even realize it. Ooh, what's that? Is it, is it the, the nomads? I want if they're the nomads. Oh, I need you so bad. Nomad animal trader. I think he has a bone dog. Uh, freeze. Come here. There's another one here. What are these guys? These are the nomads we got before. I wonder if we could talk to any of them. Another animal trader. Jesus. Maybe we got lucky. See, all these people we're seeing, I think, are a product of me. Great rich man. Uh, what? No, he's a trader. Can I talk to him? I can't talk to him. All right, whatever. Some people running back. Some people hopefully getting food. I'm going to have to watch after this episode and see if anyone... I don't think anyone's going to die, but I do have a person that's a little pissed off. Okay, let's see if we get a bone dog. I need Dreyfus. Hi, Johnny. I have animals for sale. Show me what you have. Um, I'm looking for a bone yard, a bone puppy. That's a male. He's age seven. He's a pup. They're all pups. This is a bone yard wolf pet. Female, male, female. Um... He's got good stats. She's got another five little feet. Well, zero, zero. This one's age is seven. I think this would be good. This is Dreyfus. Let's make Dreyfus. I'm going to buy you. Dreyfus, hello. Can I rant? I can't color you at all. I want to make his fur black, but it's okay. Dreyfus is 
my real life dog is a black lab and he's completely jet black and I love him to death. Um, randomize? I can't randomize. We'll call him D R E Y F U S. We'll call him Dreyfus. Okay, Dreyfus, you're going back. We got to give him some food, so I'll send him back. He should be able to make this run on his own. He's very slow. I know that. And he's going to run up here. And he's going to guard. Where's Frosty? Frosty. There she is. He's going to guard Frosty. You bodyguard Frosty. There you go. Stay close to Frostin. Bodyguard Frostin. Freeze. No, no, that's, that's not freeze. Uh, freeze. Okay, you're going there. Where's the nomads go? You come up here. I need to talk to you. Which one of you is the traitor? Aha, come here. He's running up. Oh man, I love this. I love this game so much and it drives me nuts because like, I want to do like a series of it and play like 10 hours a day, but I can't. So much you have. Um, a land pad? I've never heard of these before and I'm, I'm going to say no, thank you. Cancel. Um, do I need to feed them? Of course you need to feed them, you imbecile. <laughs> They'll eat anything you do eat and more. Eat right out of your backpacks, they will. Do they fight? Well, I wouldn't want to tussle with one, but the babies won't be much used. Okay. Very well then. Okay, so he's done. I love this, man. There's so much. I, I, like I was saying, I, I want to have a series where if I could play like three hours a day, I would, but I, the, I do the Twitch stream every day. And I'm finding this like duality of my life where I want to, I, I've been doing streaming for four and a half years, full time, uh, four years. And I can't, stop doing what I do just because I'm like, oh, I'm having fun. I'm having a lot of fun, but man, I really wish I could put a little more time into YouTube. I only got about four hours a week uh, worth of videos, which take about mm, maybe 12 hours maybe to do all the work on them. The way I'm running them, kind of what's called lazy edits, and it's a lot of fun. It's I got it. I'm having a blast. All right, I need some rice sweets. I'm going to grab like one, two, just to research it. I'm going to build all the cotton. There's a reason for that. That's for so I can grow more. I'm going to buy all your cactus because they don't go bad. His weight is 50 out of 35. I'll have to shotgun that across some of the other people, but that's okay. I do want your leather. That's five kilograms. Okay. I do want all the cloth. I'm buying what I need to make sure we can really pump out the, uh, the production as soon as I get home. Okay, so Freeze, come out here. The whole pausing aspect of this game, I think, might piss people off. I was debating joining the Shinobi Thieves, by the way, and dumping four or five people in here at a time, and I think I might do that compared to building my own training den, which is what that building Frosten's working on is becoming. Okay, you freeze. Come here. We're going to trade. Uh, I need you to trade with Mugwai because he needs to upgrade as much as possible. Okay, so Mugwai has, some, has nothing. Take all the leather. Take all the cloth. He's at 33 to 34. That should be good. Uh, take the rice weed. He's up to 18. Pause. Let's give him a little more. All the cactuses. 30. They're both about. They're both good. 20 and what's from Mogwai? 21. Perfect. Take the whole crew. Now, I did go through here. I'm going to kind of ruin a little bit of it to you. I went through all of these shops, and I found what works for me and what doesn't. And I... The ranger shop has a lot of money. Some of these other places have a lot of money. There's nothing really I, that I really need here. This place has the most. It's the um, general shop. So we're going to take the whole crew, press M. We're going to go over here. We're going to go to the way station, and we're going to click. And we'll go squint on the way back. So we'll click right in the center. I hope that works. Boom. And they should move at a pretty pretty good clip. And I'll show you along the way. I've, been, I've moved some people around. I've got um, Earthen Lady and Lori up here. They're mining ore. I've got three of the citizens, which, by the way, are the best warriors I've ever seen so far. Mine or here. And I've got a couple more over here. And that's pretty much it. And we're going to follow this crew on their way over because we're in mid. No, we're not. Now we're in mid speed. And hopefully nothing gets kind of crazy. But we should be able to follow them up. And while I'm kind of talking to you guys, which, by the way, this has been a really fun stream. Oh, sorry, a uh, series. And I thank you. A lot of you have been mashing buttons. You know which ones to push if you like what you say. And it encourages me because I really, like I said last video, I didn't expect it to blow up as much as it did. 
it, it was going to be like, oh, you know, maybe we'll have a few people come over. A lot of people came over from the channel. People, I've been looking at analytics that don't know who the hell I am, and that's fine. Uh, just, I'm just some jack off on, you know, YouTube making videos, and, I'm, and they're coming through and watching and going, hey, I like what I'm seeing. I'm like, really? Like, yeah. I've never made anything before a month ago. And I got to give a shout out to my buddy Straddle Warwich on Twitch. He's been helping me answer questions because he went to school for this shit, and I didn't. I, I was a contractor my entire life up until my back got all messed up. And it's been very helpful. So, th so thank you, those who leave me good comments. I'd love to hear, like, when I say, like, in the description, hey, I'm looking for tips, tricks, and advice, I mean it. I'm not a perfect Kenshi player. I know some, I've watched some people since I bought it back in 2013 play this game, and I'm obviously not very polished. You know what I mean? Like, I'm very, like, I can do the basics. I can put some food on people. I can medical them. I can train them. I know how to build the most rudimentary base ever. And we're pretty much at the limits of my knowledge of about three videos ago. But I'm learning, and it's forcing me to research and go, hey, where should I go? What should I do? How do I do this? And I figured out how to do um, high-end research with the four work, work, uh, research benches with people running them. Makes things very simple. It really does. Like building Cactus Farm M is, is better at the new base is done. What's all this? Uh, this is the hunting group. Are they here? They are here. You can buy meat from them, but I'm going to let them keep going for now. I love the fact that this is Project Genesis right here, and it's, and it's like perfect. For, as far as I'm aware, perfectly. You get these little camps, and they're all kinds of different stuff. Everything from hunters to farmers i don't know i don't i haven't seen any prospecting stuff but i have seen farms where instead of a little uh, this hunting thing here uh we saw it back in the original town in vain or whatever it's called um what is it called dreg in dreg there was a farm and i really liked the way the farm looked i had two little fields uh maybe three fields two little houses a well a one little um what do you call it windmill and that was it and i love seeing that 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 gives so much life to the to the world because most areas like yeah you have your towns your outposts and there's nothing between it except for roving bandits which makes sense but it's nice to see people um put so much time and effort into it you can really tell they care let's go over here we don't have anything to sell but we sure as hell have stuff to buy and we're gonna look for recruits too i can't talk to you people you're fine that's or nope Go inside, slow the speed down a little bit, go over here. Oh, my friend, hello. How can I, let's do business. Now, I need this, $8,000! Ooh, that's painful, no it's not. That's ancient science book. That's engineering. Uh, I think I need this one actually. Ow, $5,000. Okay, um, let's look for the shells thing. Basic furniture, split fencing, advanced harpoonery, signage, Random furniture, broken furniture, trade house. I already have that one. Advanced outpost blueprints. This one, this is what I'm looking for. Cannot learn this yet. Requirements large building shells. Hmm. I don't know if I, I think I have to buy large building shells because it says I don't have them. Advanced outpost blueprints. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna look for large building shells back on my base for a second before I buy this stuff. So give me a second. I'm gonna go to lazy. Nothing there. Right. Show research. Crafting core. Large building shells. Engineering research times one. That's the stale house. It's right there. I can see it at the bottom. Look. Um, large building shells, snail house. That it's it's called snail house. Okay, so engineering research times one. This is good. Um, ancient science book times four. Tech level four. Okay. Engineering research times one two. Huh. Simple dwellings, animal skin, raw iron, raw stone. I, I okay. Engineering research. That's five. It's Eleven. Ancient science books, steel bars. Regular first aid kits aren't a help for skeletons. We would need to craft special machinery kits to repair any damage. This one, robotics bench, would help me repair my guys for free. So 
I hate to be that guy, but I'm going to put it down here. Ancient science book. I'm going to write it down on my thing here. Uh, times one. Let's make sure. For robotics. Defense. I'm going to look for armor. Uh, not training. Crafting. Crafting is robotics. I think I got everything else done. Industry, maybe? Or drill. Ancient science book times two. That's three total now. Wells, three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight. Twelve. Jeez. Ancient science twelve. Twelve. 12. All total 12. Jesus. So we need 12 of these. Oof, that's painful. Smithing. Improved armor benches. Plate and armor crafting book. Hiver notebook. Doesn't matter. Um, ancient science book. That's another one. One. Engineering research seems to be the secondary. The bottom line. Engineering research times one. One. Two. Remember, I'm not perfect. That's why I'm doing this, so I can show you how painful it can be for all of us. That's two. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten engineering researches. And I'm doing this because we're going to be going across like five, ten, four or five towns. Engineering research. I'll make it ten just to make it easy. Smithing industry. Um, none of this required engineering stuff. Training. This is books, which I'm going to have to buy a lot of anyway. Advanced training dummies. Sparring master. Do you need leather fabric and books? Yeah. Farming. Rice weed, books, engineering. Re another re engineering research. Thank God I pushed it up a little bit. Okay. Some hemp would be good too. Books. Defense. Okay. Crossbow turret spotlight fitting. Book times one. Okay. Robotics slavery. I do have slave buildings. And I think there's a reason to do it. Slave hydroponic. Buildings for slaves hydroponic. Okay. I just need a lot more books. We're going to get into this because I think a lot of people have been asking for it for a long time in the game. And it never hurts. So go there. Go back to here. We're here by. Yes, sir, I am. Um, is it this one? Ancient science book. Okay, we need all these, and we need... Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, so we need, like, all these. Give me. Pause the game. I need a little more. I'm going to go up to, like... These are only 300 bucks each. I have 150000 because I knew I was going to spend a lot. I'm going to go up to another 50 of these books. 16, 32, 48, 50. <coughs> Excuse me. I will... Buy this for the one longhouses. Yes, I'm I'm being very uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> we'll buy all the cotton. We're gonna buy it on someone else. Uh Tarl Ron, you're gonna buy this. Okay, you're full. Um I could buy some more. I do need a few more of these. Tar, you're at 36, 37, 38. I'm gonna buy nine on him. Switch over to Vamp Tiger Warrior and buy nine more. Cause these guys, these cyborg things, they oh my god, they are beastly. I'm gonna pick, take him up to 50. We're gonna drop off on the way back, by the way. We're not gonna hold it and just, you know, jump everywhere. Um, and yeah, I already used $50,000. Steel bar, steel spring. Um, let me go to Blue Monkey and buy one and two. I know I have some back, but just in case. It never hurts to have more than you need than less. The leather is tempting. Very tempting. I'm gonna buy a little bit, like 20. It's costing me about 200 and that's 165 each. There's 20. Okay, all that's done. We don't need more cotton. We don't need more leather. We could use my iron plates. We're making iron plates. So I'm going to let that off for now to save some money. I could use the cotton. It's 56 each. I can't make it right now. Let's switch over to Balladeck. He's not here. Phaos. Buy all that. Oof, that's painful. Not terribly. Mugwai, you've got some stuff. Uh, Val Tom is near Slazer. He's not here, is he? No. Plasma's not here. Barnum, you are here. 
I'm gonna buy all the cotton with you. Boom. Oof! Oof! Okay. Who else is here? Uh, Barnaby, the Blue Monkey, Tardron, Mugroy, Captain Band, Vamp, Faos, Freeze. Wow, that might be too much. Let's move over here quick, see what's going on. Okay, they're all moving pretty quick. I know I could buy more cotton, but I can always come back for more cotton. We're, not, we're using way too much. Uh, also, why is that on? Did I press Alt? Yeah, I pressed Alt. Off camp the band, talk to this guy. Hey, buddy, what's up? How can I help? You'll show me your goods. Okay, now, we do need another bone dog backpack. It makes the dog able to hold his own food compared to going into the food barrel, which I think I need um, a trough to do that. That'll take care of it really quick. Black girl, crimper, robot spider, crimper, gutter. I don't know what a gutter is. Skimmer, black gorilla, crimper. I know there's one in the other town. Crimper, gutter, skimmer, gutter. Okay, so debug character spawner map. Um, this map shows the case of the reactive world debug character spawner. That's nice. Not sure what that does, but I'm going to leave it alone. Crossbow bolts. Did I not buy the, the shell? I didn't buy the shell, did I? Knapsack. That's good. Bolts regular. I don't know. Right, I'm going to buy this. I'm also going to buy the knapsack. You're going to see why in a minute. Um, I'm going to look at all the characters up here. I don't see the print. So I'm assuming I don't have it. So let's go back. And buy, I'm going to buy all this meat, too. Meat's very cheap. I'm going to freeze. 51. Wow, okay, that's not bad. Mugwai, Colt brings some on you. We're, it's, it's holding up to its name. It's a it's a way station or, a, you know, it's it's really holding up to its name. I want I would buy Cook, but we have a Cook. Um, we're going to go back over and see that quick. Now, is there anyone here we can recruit? Plastic Surgeon. I do have some names to redo, by the way. World State Checker. That's interesting. Mercenaries. I'm looking for people. Caravan Guard. Holy Pacifier. Squint. Fripp. He's a tech hunter. Thumper. I don't think the tech hunters will deal with me. Caravan Guards for tech hunters. Savannah. Skeleton. Bombington. Pinch Whip. I could get more people, and I'm not against the idea. So I'm going to see. I'm going to bring Van over here and see what we can do. I was originally captured by these Holy Nation monsters. They tried to pull me apart piece by piece. I am metal, but I still feel pain. It shudders. May I join you and hopefully find a relief? Of course. Ah, oh, well, that was easy. All right, so he'll be someone we can rename soon. I'm going to randomize him a couple times. One, two, three. You look good to me. He can't do... He can do weapon smithing plus 20%, so maybe we can have a robotic core of people that can do the, do the smithing. Sure. Ben? I was just kept, yeah, they did the same thing. Sure. So we got another one. All right. You're good too. Confirm. Savannah. It's all the same thing. Join us. <laughs> I love it. 87 people. This is insane. Confirm. Okay, you three. Do you have anything on you? No. 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 Okay. You three. Come together. How fast do you run? You don't run very fast. We don't need any metal or anything else. So we're going to put you up to, where's our base? Uh, outpost? Your outpost, right here. So I'm going to click, like, right there and have them go. Bye, boys. Hope you make it. Okay. Let's go talk to this guy back here. Need a merc. I'm looking to hire some bodyguards. Need some merc to guard my outpost. Let's talk about other things. What are the requirements? Can you give me a job? How about having security guard work? Uh, check mission detail. What security job? There are not enough security guards in, this t in the town. They have no time to rest, so we'll do it on their behalf. Okay. It is necessary to protect the town because security guards' clients in the town will take a two-day break. No. No, I'm good. I see this. Okay, so he's just a guard giver. What's this guy? Squint. Holy pacifier. Gardening trader? I don't need this crap. I will go back over. I'm not going to forget the building shells. I'm going to buy that. Oh, I'm so happy. Stop saving. 
Okay. Maybe I shouldn't say, but I've had some crashes because of all the things running. Who's this guy? Flick. If he wasn't a, a shack, I would get him because they, they, apparently they eat double what other people eat. And I was like, oh, man, I didn't know that. So where's Ban? Captain Ban. Talk to this dude. So what you have? Random furniture. Grand Sarpoonery. Advanced Outpost. We're buying this one. 15 grand. Boom. Because it wasn't in there. So, yeah. Advanced Harpoonery, no. Trade House, already known. Old Headquarters needs the one I'm getting. But I... It says HQ 1 and 2. I don't know what those are. So I'm not going to go for them yet. Um, signage. It's a thousand bucks. Do I want this? Sign boots, sign bar. I guess it gives character. Eh. Eh. <laughs> eh. We'll take it all. Wait, it is. Move everyone out here and just look through our people quick. Faos, come over here. Why is Faos stuck? Come on, Faos. Now, someone told me if I take off this thing, it'll show the, low, the slowest characters. Which seems to be Barnaby Mugwai and... Yeah, Barnaby Mugwai. So, okay. So, we're going to move them around. What do you got? You've got almost nothing. So, you trade with Barnaby. It's a good tip, by the way. Thank you for telling me that. Give him all this. He's down to 31. He's up to 42. Give him that. 35. I think that's a fair trade. Now, what's your speed, Barnaby? 15. Really? 21, 17. I don't think it really matters, to be honest, but I want to make sure we're not that slow. Vamp, do you have anything on you? You have, like, nothing. Here, trade with him. And take, like, half this crap. 52 to 32. That should make him faster. You're at 28 now. I'm going to go get a couple more of these building materials quick. Because I know I don't have any more, and I'm not making any. Like, I, I'm getting close to the point where I can if I want to, but is it really worth it? I'm running out of manpower, funny enough. Don't don't laugh. I know. I know. I know. You're like, what? I know. I, I know. It, it shouldn't be, but it is. 16. Let's give me all those. You're at 69. <laughs> nice. Let's see how fast you run. 21 still. This guy's a beast. I love him. Go vamp. And Blue Monkey's still running. I could get something on Blue Monkey. What does Blue Monkey have? Where are you? You are right here. What do you got on you? Oh, two steel bars, eight cloth. Eh. I think we're good. We're going to go run back. Battery power, three complete. Let's go run back to the outpost. We got some people up here at the campfire. I don't know what that is. Dust Bandit Camp 50. That's right outside of Squin. Not sure who that is. What's the dialogue say? Uh, do we have anyone showing up? Faction, maybe? Upcoming events. Return for tribute. Two days, six hours. So they show up, and they want food. So I'm, what I'm going to do is just move the food out <laughs> while they, uh, they're in, and I think that still works. Man, why not? Like, eh, wouldn't you do that in real life? Okay. So there's something there. Not sure what it is. I'm going to mark here. Go there and tell them move. Let them go and then go back to my base. See what the hell that is. Something's down there. I don't know what it is. I don't see anything. The hell is it? There's nothing here. Are we onward? It's it's over. Apparently, it's over. It's over here. Oh, Lynn the Trader. I know you. You're th okay. What's this guy? This trader, I'm not sure why she's here, but she's here. She's trading like in the middle of the street. Is she pissed at me? Faction. Uh, free traders? No, they don't mind. Holy Nation refugees like me. Nomads like me. Slave hunters and slave traders hate me. Starving bandits, of course. Dust bandits, of course. All right. No idea. Does he runs back with some gear, I think? Nope. Why is she running back? Getting food. Well, why don't you take some food first? Wait. 
Here, we'll bring her back up here and uh, abuse her a little bit when it comes to hauling. Because she's got nothing. I wish they would always do that automatically. You set some settings. Here you go, Dizzy. Get your sweat on. She's like, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm slower now. Yep, have fun with that. Uh, don't worry. Look at, her, look at her strength, though. Look at her strength. It's 15. And by the second, it's going up almost. 89. 90. Go, Dizzy. Uh, my, my legs are screaming. It's okay. I don't mind. But you're not me. It's okay. Shh. Worst friend ever. Worst friend ever. All right, so now we're back up here. And now we're doing this big world tour. We've got that town and that town done. Squin can be done. I'm going to go over to Battle Deck and them quick while they're doing this. Slazer and all them are up here, and they're ready to trade. So let's go get rid of some stuff. Trade. You've got some gear. So I'll buy, buy, buy. Do I know that? Yes. And know this. Yes. So we get some more meat. Take all the meat off you. He might run at home. Battle deck. Run to this dude. Plasma run over here. Show what you got. Okay. All that's gone. What's this? Uh, banner designs already known. Already known. Take all the meat. What's this? Trader's backpack already known. Some fish we don't need. They're too expensive. Good enough. Now you. I love going to these little street vendors and filling them up with ore for no reason. It's hilarious to me. It's like, what do you got? Money? No, I got some ore. Oh. Well, I don't really need ore as a, as a merchant. No, no, no. You need some ore. Uh, oh, okay. Have fun with that. This little apartment, by the way, is quickly outliving its usefulness. And I know it's going to be ending soon where we get rid of it and we just move out of the area completely. I know we're kind of in the uh, very much scrub face, phase or whatever you want to call it. But I have no choice. I need some food. All these people get outside except for Glitterbrett, who's our cook. There's Dreyf. Does he have any food on him? He does have one more food. Top Cat's doing a research, or Top Cat's wife, rather. There's some ore there. Minute Designer. They're going to keep dropping ore off. Yeah. What are you doing? Get out. I told you get out. I literally told you, get out. Here's all these guys. So what we're going to do is fill them up with ore. I've been doing this off stream like crazy, and I don't like this, but I have no choice. So battle deck, come here. First of all, let's get, hand over all the meat. Trade with her. Trade with Little Red. Take it all to Little Red. And then she can take that too. And then she can take this three. And then she's cooking, and good for you. So she'll cook a lot. Baladek, take this. Oh, by the way, I got these two. Uh, bolts, regular. I already have that one. Just bought it. Invalid container type. I don't want to contain it here. Learn this. Here's the other thing. Tech Hunter library map. Towns, lost library. Let's see what that is. Press M. Close this. Oh, Jesus. It's all the way up there. Wow. There's one up here on the Leviathan Coast. I bought this for some money. I wanted to show you guys all of this live well, you know, recorded, not me going, oh, I have it. I just got it. No, no. I want to show you where it came from. So battle deck again. Map to World's End. Uh, World's End is the outlaw, outland stronghold of the Machinist University. Tech Hunters use the main home base when it's one north. Okay. Where's this? Ah, here we go. I've never seen this before. Okay, so I guess that's a town. Okay, there you go. So battle deck, go here. There's a lot of ore. They're going to move very slow. Oh, Jesus. Maybe not that slow. Let's make it like 200. 200 seems fine. 200 for these guys is a bit much. Battle deck's full. Plasma. Take all that. Take all, oof. He's a robot, but there's limits, you know. Okay, then Slazer. They're all three of these guys are robots. Our robot core is remarkably well done. I'm very shocked how good they are when it comes down to it. Oh my god. Okay, 200 each. Plasma, Slazer, Baladek. Please run over here. And let's go sell some more shit. They're not going to move fast. I know they're not going to move fast. 
and we've had nothing pop up. I'm the remake new squads, and this is the one thing I've been telling people on my stream for a long time. When I did this, I've been planning this for literally like two or three years. I didn't expect it to be this good. All I had was the mod that gave 255 people in your um, faction compared to 24. So you got infinite squads and kind of stuff. When Project Genesis came out, I was like, I need to do this now. It kind of like made me go, ooh, I want to go do this. So my original thought was have a base for farming, another one for mining, another one for um, the mining base would also be the crafting base. And then we'd have another one for training and then another place maybe randomly to stab locations for trading or something like that. And I had all these ideas and I threw all that away when I started this because I was like, you know what? We want to play something brand new. We want to try something we've never done before, and we want to try it fresh. So I did. Here's these three guys. Wow, Vamp is out running everyone. Oh, I have the wrong setting on. Where's Captain Bannon? Okay. So when these guys come up, wow, they're all running the wrong thing because I set it wrong. Wow. Anyway. So yeah. Um, ah, crap. Pastors got attacked. Who? Raffle Monk. Really? Who? Okay, these sh schmucks over here. You hungry bandits? I'm assuming you are. Yeah, hungry bandits. They're starving. They have stat penalties. Bad. I don't see any more. There's only two. No, there's three. One, two, three. They might be able to beat them up by themselves. Their attack is minus nine, minus one. I mean, I'm kind of... Oh, no, there's a lot more. There's a lot more. Here's the Hungry Bandit leader. He's got... Maybe. He's got a sword. So you three. Two, rather. Where's Raziel? I don't see Raziel. He's probably always oh, running back. Okay, so Raziel? Or you two? Jump, run out here. He's going to run. Brave Sir Robin, he ran away. And Josie will join him another day. By the time they run out, and this matters, they they, they might catch up the Raziel, but I'm thinking the guards are going to catch up to them first. Here, Josie, do me a favor. Trade with him for one second. No, damn it. Stop. Josie doesn't have f footwear. Yes, yeah, she does. One, two, three, four. That should do it. Yeah, they're being followed, but it doesn't matter. I'm hoping by doing this, they're going to be good. I think the guards will trigger shortly. I'm going to make Josie run over here to this guy. Same with Raziel. Yeah, they're running pretty good. These, these guards are going to slaughter these guys. They're, they're not worth even picking over. All they have is one guy who has, like, his his um, sword is the only thing worth that entire group. They have no food. They have no meds, I don't think. Gives me a chance to look up here too. Menacing stare, battery capacity too. Here, have a piece of food. Enjoy. Uh, Raziel. Hmm, let's try it. Get rid of this junk and this shitty died. Well, died turbine isn't bad. All right, so you got that then. Have a piece of food. Go do your thing. So they're kicking the crap out of these guys now. And I mean, when I say kicking the crap out of them, I mean they are kicking the crap out of them. Over here, help. Wait, what? Wow, you went all the way over there just to hit Josie. All right, you're a dick. Go that way. I don't think it would be that bad. Foreign, get out of here. Jesus, man, come on. Okay, that's the leader, by the way. I was wondering what they were going to do. Now, I could go smack these guys in the face. I still don't feel like I'm ready to, in terms of, like, wasting time on this. Okay, they're all beaten. Now they're going to go after the leader, who's somewhere. I think he's in the middle of the town. So when he comes up here... The guards should engage them. If not, these guards will get them. Someone's going to get them. There we go. 
And we're saving again because we always save. Don't worry about these guys. Now, come on in here and sell this crap off. Is the leader? Wow, he's re he just almost lost his arm and he's like, I gotta keep chasing her. I gotta keep chasing her. Okay, man, have fun with that. Like, he's gonna get smoked. There he goes. I would care, but he's only, like I said, he's only got a sword. And some of you are probably like, well, Ben, why are you doing what you're doing the way you're doing it? Well, I'm trying to make it where, I me, mean, yeah, I can bring people out and then heal up and that's fine, but I want to get this run of these house places done as quick as possible. And from there, I want to be able to go um, right into um, weapon manufacture. And it's really driving me nuts because it's, it's been taking too long. Baladek? Not Baladek. It is Baladek. Okay, so all the money's pretty much gone. We're back up to 98 grand. They bought all this junk. I did buy some weapon stuff, but I already showed you all that. So we'll go next door. To this area. Fine. And this guy's still alive? Nope. He's already been captured. I don't know what they do with, with uh, the people. I really don't. That's the one thing I don't know. We might have to break this across two episodes. And actually, I just noticed how time it is. I'm trying to do a 45 minutes of one hour long episode every time I do this. One, it's very easy for me. It's fun. It's convenient. It fits my time frame. But the other thing is, I think a lot of you don't mind putting it on and pushing it to, uh, you know, an hour. Now, if you want a shorter episode, that's fine. But I'll have to, like, I can't do jump cuts yet. I don't have the skills yet. If you guys want to see small, shorter episodes, say 30, 45 minutes, just say 30, 45 minutes down below. Like, give me your opinion. I don't mind. But if I keep doing hour-long videos, don't get pissed off and go, well, I, my opinion wasn't heard. Well, I'm, I'm doing what I can. You know, because this is a very long, complex game. And breaking it down to 20-minute episodes means I can record once, one night, and have, like, 50 episodes done, it seems. And while that's good, it's also annoying. Uh, iron hat, we have that. Armored faceplate, 75%. No. This is the tin can. 100% head coverage. Dodge skill effect, minus, uh, basically minus 30%. Melee attack bonus, minus 5. Perception bonus, minus 25, 20. Ow, this one, police helmet. Crossbow and dodge are worse. Melee attack is worse, but it's not as bad as the uh, the tin can. It's oh, I don't know what to bring for my. Is there a suggestion? I'm really open to it. I don't know what to use, man. I really don't. In terms of like my helmets, I do kind of like the samurai boots. Um, I kind of like the uh, are these the plated long boots. They're not bad either. They're not great, but they're not terrible. Um, I'm looking for a suggestion. If someone could give me one. Here's the plate jacket, but this is the other one. I want the visor to helmet? No. Right click to learn? Really? Huh. I guess we'll learn this one. I don't see it. So we'll visor to helmet. Bring buy that. Plated short boots. Um I think these are the plated those are the plated long boots. That's samurai boots. Hmm. I don't know. I'm also looking for this plate jacket. I've got the black plate jacket, but armored hood, we already know that one. Samurai boots, samurai leg plates. Missionary plate, I'm bought because it's expensive as hell. Samurai cloth pants, spiked helmet, know that one. Samurai helmet, armored rag skirt. Drifter leather pants, tricorn hat, sidecourt, no. Drifter, armored plate jacket, no. Black plate jacket. I hope this one is one. More. This is the same thing as that one. It's only just died. All right, so that's fine. Uh, what's about this one? Mercenary leather armor. Mm, no, we have a lot of leather though. Mast helmet. We already know that one. There's the visored helmet. Armored face plates. Huh. Tin can. The tin can's this thing. Police helmet's what I want. I don't think I have the police helmet capacity. In any way, shape, or form. I don't think I have the ability to buy it. Wish I knew. Oh, well. It's fine. All right, so we got this. Go to Ballot Deck again. Learn it. Visored helmets. And we'll bring these guys back while um, what's going on is going on. Okay. Now back up to our base. They should be here. Yep. These guys are brand new um, workers, I guess. 
So they're here. What can we do with these people? Now we got three robots, which by the way, Patreons can be named after these people too. Not completely selling out, just a little bit. <laughs> and they're building this. So let's go over here, bring all of our people here and come over here. Now we, those robots, if I remember correctly, have a little bit of, let's look at their stats. Weaponsmith four. Uh, Weaponsmith, no. Four, one, three. So there are there are fallback if we don't have better people. Like we're trying to go to, I'm gonna look at Squin and I'm gonna look up there in the hub. We're gonna go to the hub right away because we're already getting kind of long in this episode. We go over here and ditch all these resources. Blue Monkey, you're first. What do you got? You've got nothing. You've got nothing. I need to dump. You do. That's wrong. Shoot. Okay. Cloth. Vamp. Nope. Cloth. Mogwai. Uh, okay. Come in here. Oh, this one. And they're cooking, by the way. They're cooking. I'm going to look it off stream and see if I can fix it. It's busted. Um, you go there. What else do you got? You've got some cloth, some stuff from that. You need to go in here. Captain Ben, you've got the research. You go in there. Trying to sort all this crap out as soon as you come back is always like the thing you should always attack, attack first. Because my god, it gets out of control quickly. Barnaby, up in there. Freeze, meat. Go in there. Oop. The rest go in there. Okay. Blue monkey. I think you've got nothing but building. No, you're the same shit. You go in there. Vamp Tiger Warrior. You're mostly building materials. You go there. And that should leave Barnaby the stowaway with all his leather and stuff. You go in there. Perfect. Like I said, just taking all the stuff out of your inventory. Don't let it sit because it gets out of control quick. Now there's some building materials there. Build all the rest. Good. Get inside. Vamp Tiger Warrior. Same thing. Boop, 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 boop. Get inside. Now, Frost and Jay guys should still be building this. They are still building it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're still building. Wow. Okay, now in here, Van, Van has to go in here. She's going to open up all of this. Um, bolt regulars we know. Knapsack. Advanced outpost blueprints. So we need all this, 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 this. We're going to go straight down the line just to get... Where is it? Um, advanced outpost blueprints. Large building shells. That's what we need. Large building shells. So I'll put that down there so I know. We can learn that. We already know this. That's that's useless. Already known, already known. We have to sell them off. Actually, let's bring them in here and sell them off because we already know them. There's no reason to keep them. Yeah, so we have a little bit of extra stuff. Um, okay. Close that. Stop. Stop. Go to ban. Knapsack, learn knapsacks, good. Go here, go to research. We need crap, I think it's core. Large building shells. It's at the bottom, we'll bring it all the way to the top. Even over light post, well now light post is one hour, so we'll let that go there. And then from there, as soon as that's learned, we should be able to get this. Advanced Outpost Blueprints. So I'm not going to touch anything else. I'm not going to add anything else in. I know there's core stuff I can get there, like Tech Level 4. It takes an Ancient Science book times 4. Eh, meh. The cost's already paid. What about industry? Steel bars. Steel bars, are used, we, can, uh, we can find them from raw iron ore. Oh! Or get the ore drill. One, two... Four. Oh my god. Automated mining tech. An AI core or drill. Mm. Oh my god. Alright, we're gonna <laughs> executive decision. Or drill, steel bars. It's gonna pay the cost. I know that. That's a fine. Um we're gonna let that go a little bit. No. Well, we'll bring it up here because steel bars should be in front of but next to robotics, which I think we already have. Not that high. Do I have robotics anywhere up here? 
We might have already gotten it. Wait, make sure I have. That's the one I, I, the reason I did this. Um, defense, craft robotics. There, boom. Good. That was the. We need these. Can bring me the skeleton beds. The skeleton beds will let me. Um, how does this happen? Come on. Skeleton beds will let me repair my people, my skeletons for free, and my base in the area around it. And meaning all those little kits I keep buying, no more, you know? All right, so we'll leave it like this. We'll see what happens. That's going to be four hours in game. Uh, all right, next person, are you done? Okay, you're pretty much done. Vamp, you've got cloth, which is all going here. Dump, done. Vamp, get outside. Band, get outside. Barnaby. This will help me make big backpacks for my people. See these backpacks right here, the large backpack? I can make these now with the backpack bench. If you look at right here, backpack bench, Q. Uh, it's called a large backpack, I believe? No. Trader wooden backpack. Uh, small backpack, thief backpack. I think it's thieves. Yeah, that's this, it makes the small one. I don't want that one. But if you make the go to the second bench right here, Q, the large backpack right there. You don't need the large backpack, by the way. I'm just trying to put backpacks on all my people for ease of use. Uh, it does help them if you're, like, trying to haul a lot of stuff. Um, it won't hurt to have a backpack if you have a smaller one compared to the giant ones I'm, I'm showing you. And I think that's okay. So let's, let's get all this over here. Barnaby's done. No, you're not. Take all that, too. He's set up for that range on go. Mogwai. All right, we're gonna go to this. We're gonna go in here. I'm gonna dump in the um, the rice weed. I think that's all he needs. There, we'll put the rest of it in here. Uh, dump, 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 dump. Keep the cubes for the people that are with them, and we're gonna go over here. We're gonna dump in all this. Oh, you can make more stuff. Go outside. This guy bacon here is making these two work plus like right now we have a wheat farm that is growing i'm not sure how it's growing but it's growing um cactus farm that farm this guy though doesn't seem to want to sit there he likes to sit by this bit this building and do nothing so i'm not really sure if that's his job or not operating machine cactus farm operating machine wheat farm I'm going to put that underneath that and see what happens. Maybe he'll do his job. I don't know. I don't know how this works. I'm, I'm still learning farming. Uh, we'll go here. This is cotton. We can turn cotton into cloth. If I can find the loom. I have the loom, but it doesn't say it works. Like the loom I built is this one. It's input hemp, output fabric. This one is input fabric, output cloth, clothing. How do you input, where do you put cloth into, like I, it said loom, but I can't build a loom that I know of. That'll work. So I'm asking chat politely because I don't actually know. I thought it was the loom. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's another research I don't have. We'll look in a second while they're moving. Okay, you're up there. That's more cotton. See, build, buying crops is not terrible. Faos, more of this. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Big shout out to Mugwai if you're watching this, man. I know you've been wanting to see a base build set up, and you can tell it's not the hardest thing in the world to do. It's just really annoying. Boom, boom. And these steel bars are going to go up here, I believe. Yes. For research and something. I don't remember what, though. I think it's robotics. I think, I'm, I, think I paid the cost. Whatever. Can't hurt to have two more up there. Okay, so all these guys again. Grab them all. They've already got food because they're all together. I'm going to send them over to the hub. I don't know why this guy is here. Should I go talk to Lynn? I'm going to talk to her quick. No, I'm going to keep my damn promise to myself. Where's the hub? The hub is right here, but we can see it. So we're going to put ourselves in the hub. We're going to run together, first of all. So run like this. Go back to the hub. And press this. I think I can see that tower. That's the black tower. Because I need to find that one, that person. Are they running together? Yeah, they're running pretty good. Okay, now that's done. Um, I'm going to see who that trader is down there. I'm going to grab these three people. These are going to be my new, uh, what do you call them? Um, gopher people. They're going to go for this, go for that, that kind of stuff. So you come here, Bombington. 
I'm hoping I can rename them, but I'm not going to beg for people for new Patreons. I'm just going to say, hey, look, it's there if you want it. Hopefully that's nice enough by, by not making this channel into a begging thing. I think a lot of people will appreciate it more than if I go, oh, my God, guys, Patreon. I think you know about it. Most people are pretty intelligent. They, they can do it anyway. Let's go over here. We're going to grab a little bit. They got to Let me just I guess they have no stats, right? Athletics 15, 19, 15, 18. God, they suck. I don't know if they have robotics 9 is the highest and laboring 12. Robotics 14, robotics 11. They're all laborers, robotics, medics. Okay. I can deal with that. I'm going to grab these people. We're going to grab some ore. We're going to go right on down the thing and get rid of it. Storage full, almost full. Jeez, that's full. We'll grab some, some of this copper stuff. Not a lot. What? Oh. Why did, why did you, okay. Why did you grab that? Let's see. Let's push these guys up to like 35. Actually, it doesn't matter because we're close. 16 each. How about that? That should give them some um, exercise. What do you call it? training? Whatever you call. Them. 16 here. Okay, there we go. So you three, come on down here. We're going to run you over to this trader. She was in the middle of the road for whatever reason. Let's see how slow they move. Yeah, they're, they're moving okay. I'm not sure how skeletons technically, um, you know, muscle up, but okay. You know, they're going to get there pretty quick. And there are some hungry bandits down here. The slavery mod, I'll, I'll talk about in the next video, just so you guys all know. I don't want to touch on it too much, but I think it's going to be kind of fun. Uh, you'll, you'll understand my reasoning why once I explain it at the start of the next video. I'll try to remember if I, if I can. Um, also, thank you very much for those of you that are watching and doing this thing. You know, Thank you for hitting the buttons down below. You know which ones I'm talking about. Um, thank you for the series. It's been a lot of fun, i got to admit. And we just finished the longhouse. So now that that's done, we have a place to do training or in here. I think this, this will be the training house and this will not be. Maybe, I'm not sure what I should do with these buildings yet, so we'll see. All right, let's get out of here. I'll see you in the next episode, and thank you very much. Bye.